Hello, hi, my name is Fatima Rashid and I am 43 years old. I learned I have uh, chronic kidney disease at stage 3A when I was 33 and pregnant. 2022, in April, I suffered an acute kidney injury made um, holding my disease at end stage any longer very difficult. I signed up to be on the transplant list. I received a kidney on the 10th of January. I was afraid of having a kidney transplant. It feels more challenging when you're actually physically trying to cope with living and existing. From the moment of the phone call till the actual surgery, the process was fairly quick. You are expected to show up at the hospital as soon as possible. And from then on, you are prepped for surgery. Um, lots of tests are carried out. They basically brief you on what to expect. They carry out a whole range of tests. And once the results come back, you know if you are it. So it all happens um, within a span of 12 hours, but it feels like a very long day. I cannot imagine in ways my life has changed. A few months before the surgery, um, I was having a discussion with my husband and I told him, I don't want a transplant. It's terrifying, uh, the medications, the side effects. I lacked the imagination of what what can happen post-surgery. And here I am saying that this is something I could have never imagined. The trajectory of recovery is different for each patient, of course. If I could say something to someone who is on the fence about getting organ transplant, I'd say, pick the courage and just go for it. Because once you're at the bottom of the barrel, the only way to go is up. Science has definitely uh, jumped in leaps. It definitely has uh, given people a lease of life, not just the lease of life, it has also improved the quality of life of the patients, the recipients, the drugs that we are right now taking. It's like a double-edged sword for the moment. Um, you never know how this works out down the line. There's always more drugs being looked into, there's always alternative um, treatments being considered to, to uh, to help with uh, transplanted organs. With the current pace of advancement in science, especially here in Dubai, because I believe the city is definitely invested and at par with all the latest technology.